We've decided his name is Arnold, question mark? Yeah, Arnold. Arnold, the Terminator Cobra. <laughs> Bro, that is like perfect fit. Seeing a new edge with actual good fit. Good morning. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, me and Poe are up here at the shop. We came zooming up in the ZL1, and we've got one task at hand today, and that is it. Well, technically, two. First off, We've got to play musical chairs inside of the shop because my shop is definitely not big enough. Got to get the McLaren, the Miata, and the truck moved out. We'll probably leave the Camaro and the black car where it's at. Ducati is up here for the first time in a really long time. Oh my God, this thing looks beautiful. But our goal today for number two is going to be completely transforming the Terminator Cobra Arnold. As you guys know, uh, or maybe you don't know, today right now actually starts the giveaway with this car. So if you guys want to go grab your entries in to win this thing, you can go to itsjustasix.com and get entered. But today, we are going to be, being that it is the start of the giveaway, we're going to be completely converting this car from a stock, pretty typical, boring Terminator to probably one of the coolest and craziest Terminators that you've ever seen, ever. The quick rundown though, we're going to be doing wheels, tires, headlights, roof wrap, roof wrap, roof wrap, coilovers, and a few other things. So we've got quite the list of stuff to do today. So that's why we're up here pretty early. We're going to get all this stuff knocked out. So. Let me go ahead and get all these damn cars moved out of the shop, make some room, and put the termi up on the two posts and get started. No! Is it really? No fucking way! It really is. It's actually dead. Luckily, I've been here before. <laughs> I don't know why this car, this is the second time that this car has died. I drive this thing a lot too. It's cold in Louisiana and all the batteries don't know what to do. Let's see if it'll fucking start. So about a year ago, uh, you guys probably saw a video that we dropped, if not basically the premise of the video, we went and got Nick and Daniel new cars. We went all the way to Dallas. Nick picked up a new Porsche Cayman. Daniel uh, went and picked up a 2018 Mustang. Today, Nick is on his way back to Dallas. He's actually trading his Porsche in on a new car that you guys are gonna have to wait till the end of the video to see. But basically, the goal also, as well as getting all this stuff modded on the Terminator, we're trying to have it all done by the time he gets back because we're gonna try to race the Terminator against his new car. And I have a feeling it's gonna be pretty damn cool. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Let me make it a little, make it a little cold start. Oh, that is kind of funny. The intake genuinely. Is I know. I don't know here. why the. <laughs> that shit's hilarious. Hey, this might be my favorite one. <laughs> We've decided his name is Arnold? Question mark. Yeah, Arnold. Arnold, the Terminator Cobra. All right, we've got a few of our parts laid out all across the ground right here. Poe's joking around, but it's kind of serious. This is literally like the new edge starter kit. Um, we've got BC coilovers. We've got some tires. I'm going to show you guys the wheels, but first, check this out. Literally a 335, dude. We've also got a front splitter. We've got a rear diffuser. And as Poe is showing, this is the most bougie thing about freaking two valves, or well, the new edge body style at least. This is the, the amber, amber tail lights for the Cobra Mustangs. It's crazy. It's like a cult thing. It's hard to explain. Crazy enough, um, these tail lights, I was <laughs> well, almost embarrassed to say this, but I was literally in a bidding war on eBay and I ended up buying the cheapest set that I've seen sold on eBay yet and I bought them for $900 <laughs> on some freaking amber tail lights. <laughs> and for our $80 headlights, <laughs> we got some really nice clear housing, um, OEM style headlights. These things are like my favorite headlights for these cars. So even though they are cheap, this is like really my go-to. And then also uh, to replace our cheap little plastic vents in the hood. So we're gonna get those swapped out with some really nice billet CNC parts right there. We should be able to see straight down into the engine bay. It should be awesome. And uh, Last thing that I need to show you guys is our wheels. Ready, 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 ready. Ugh. We've got an 11 wide in the rear that is gonna have a 335 on it and uh, lowered on those coilovers. I have a feeling it's gonna look pretty damn crazy. So, oh yeah, oh yeah. We also are doing complete brake system on the car. Behind our new wheels, we don't wanna see just plain rotors. So our buddies at R1 Concepts make some amazing brakes 
for pretty much every car guys if you want to go check them out go click the link down below but basically we've got some ceramic pads here and then check out our new rotors for this car no more boring ugly rotors those are going to look freaking mint behind our wheels so okay i'm getting really really excited so we're gonna go ahead and dive in coming in yeah flex i just want to win yeah la baby who we running with yeah two two three three i'm on ten again Yes. Bo, Bo approves. Yes. Damn. Bro, that is like perfect fitment. Seeing too. a new edge with actual good fitment. What? Ooh. Ooh, that looks so good. Oh my god, bro. That's quite ridiculous. <laughs> so big bags coming, uh -huh. coming in. Yeah. Flex. I just want to win. Yeah. LA baby, who we running with? Yeah. I'm on 10 again. Pump up the action. Ooh, so good, dude. What? What's this coilover on there? And the car's like on the ground. Bro, it's crazy how nice this fitment actually is. <laughs> what? This thing's gonna look fire. Don't gotta sell them most Alice Lord is broken with as long as it is foreign. Hold you wanna cut the yams and rumors. What's an ass? She is a gorgeous. Live my life last name of Morgan Freeman. Trying to touch a forest. Do not know we're knocking on the door. This came in, I came in, I came in. Did it like the forces coming in. Yeah. Flex, I just wanna win. Yeah. LA BB, who we running with? Yeah. Two, two, three, three, I'm on ten again. Okay, alright. Coming in. Yeah. Flex, I just wanna win. <laughs> Guys, we have already made some crazy progress on this car, and it is coming together looking insane already uh real quick we've already posed gone ahead and disassembled all the stock suspension and gotten all the brakes blown apart off of it in this box we've got our new coilovers that we're going to be installing on the car so i want to give a huge thanks to parker performance if you want to check them out they are like the go-to spot to get all your aftermarket needs for your car and uh they sell a lot of stuff for mustangs and speaking of mustangs kind of like a little teaser real quick next week we're going to be doing some stuff to Jess's car, and Parker Performance has been helping us out with a lot of stuff for the EcoBoost platform, so uh, you'll have to see what's coming up for that. It's going to be pretty cool, but in this box, let's check out our new coilovers. Ooh, shit. Those are the units right there. Holy adjustable caster and camber out top. Oh my goodness, dude. This is a really sick looking coilover. Now these are the new rear shock. Ooh I'm so excited. I really am. Like, yeah. I haven't been this excited to mod a car in a bit. I think I've just always had, like, a secret hidden fucking, like, fetish for Terminators. <laughs> <laughs> that is OP. <laughs> it really is, bro. Oh, that is like, dope. instead of fighting with that shit for 20 fucking minutes and almost killing yourself, this thing just makes it simple as I guess that works. Literally it. That is a unit of yeah. machine right there. Yeah. Nice. You can do it. Oh, you can do it. Nice, bro. At this point, we just gotta finish throwing on our new R1 Concepts brakes, which are gonna look so sick. And then the last step is legitimately just slapping a wheel and tire on there, bolting that thing up and dropping it on the ground. Obviously, we're not anywhere close to being done, but man, this is the first step to really being able to see part of the transformation. And we're working our way pretty much from the bottom to the top today, so got a few more things to go. You gotta peel off each letter individually. Yeah. Just in case you don't know, though, Gavin's really good at putting on stickers. I've gotten better over the years, I'll <laughs> say. Oh, shit. All right, what's B stand for? <laughs> Oh shit, bro. Bees for bro. Wait, 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 bro. What's the R stand for? Re. <laughs> What's the A stand for? <laughs> asparagus. Uh, asparagus is good as f***. Bro, I would munch some asparagus Dude, at the moment. Is there anywhere Dude, that just has Gavin asparagus in town? I'm, I'm hungry, it's what I am. <laughs> I'm hungry as f***. This is about to be the goofiest, most expensive upgrade. I'm gonna do one side first, so that way you can see side versus side at how minimal of a change this is for the money. <laughs> having those taillights is just kind of like having an NFT. It's not really for any purpose other than just to be like, ha, ah, I have that and you don't. Damn, dude. Why is this car so clean? There we go. 
these do seem somewhat incomplete now. It gives it just a little bit more definition. Yeah, seeing it like this, this is definitely making it worth it now. It's been a long time, but back whenever I had the 370Z, actually coincidentally, I had R1 Concepts brakes on it way back in the gap. And that's the last time that I've ever messed with R1. So really cool stuff for sure. Huge Jeez. thanks to those guys. Facts. Very All three cool. of us are sponsored by R1. That is facts, actually. All three oh, yeah. of us are sponsored by ah, R1. That's pretty cool. Uh, we can put brakes, or not brakes, we can put wheels on the rear. Yeah, we can put rear uh, wheels on rear. Um, that looks so mother freaking beautiful. That do look mother freaking oh, beautiful. Oh my God. When that thing sits on the ground, son. I hope it's not sitting so low that we can't drive it to the alignment shop. We'll see. Yeah. Go low. Lower than you know. Hey. Go low. Hey, go hey. low. Low? L -l Lower than you know. Low. Go low. Go. Go, go low. Yo. Hit the quan. L -l Hit the quan. <laughs> Hit the quan. Get down low and swing your arm. 70,000 likes, I'll hit the quan for 24 hours straight. Oh my God. <laughs> that would be so horrible. You know, I'm really happy with that. Yeah. <laughs> that shit looks good. It does. Like really great. New pads going in. Guys, the freaking brakes are done, completed up front. Coilover is installed, sway bar is back connected, which means our wheels are good to go on up front. And then after that, I think we're good to lower this thing down on the ground and actually move it off the lift. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, real, I'm really excited. Real, real, real excited. Oh my God, dude. So Holy shit. Oh my god. Bro. <laughs> Bro, I'm really in love. Look at the fitment. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, that's gonna look sick. All right, one more wheel up front left. These are light. Yeah, I know, and that's the heavy ones too. The rears are way wow, lighter. That's super light. I can't wait to go take pictures of this thing. It's gonna look so good. God. Now let's stick it where we'll never see it. <laughs> Are you nervous? Yeah, <laughs> that doesn't feel right. I know you don't want to. Do a pull. Holy fucking cheese, dude! Alright, I gotta see it now. It's I wasn't gonna go at Cheese! <laughs> Have you looked at that? No, not yet. No. <laughs> Dabber, Dabber. Pretty solid. Yeah, yeah. That thing ought to be split. Really? Like really solid, actually. Diffusing. Damn. This thing's playing Search and Destroy because oh it just done diffuse, son. Yeah, diffuse the bomb. That's very solid. Bomb diffused. Chain that will be paid for in 2080. Three of those hoes on there. <laughs> Yesterday compared to how it is now, it is crazy. Bro, this bitch is crazy. It's like more than what I can actually explain different. <laughs> Every mod anyone would want to do to make their car drive better was done today. So like, yeah. <laughs> usually people do one thing at a time. Yeah. Yeah, the, the rears just look goofy right now because they're towed in and they're sitting up straight on like a straight axle. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, a degree and a half. Oh yeah. And that thing is gonna look nutty. Damn, I'm lit. All right, well, we got the, 
Got Arnold the old termy tucked away. And we're gonna see you guys tomorrow. I gotta get this thing aligned too. See y'all tomorrow. <laughs> Damn boy! these cars now. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You see the height? Yeah. yeah. Can I do a sit? Dude, yeah. Come in that bitch. Damn, this is Nick, way sicker a person. Damn, this, this thing's thing. clean. Hey. God, I forgot how big these cars are. Yeah, dude. It's dope. This sounds good, too. This is sick. This is so fucking sick. Dude, this thing's fast. Bro, this shit's sick. Yeah, this car is very fucking cool. Yeah, there's, there's, a, like, there's already like a few things I really want. Oh, it's got a double piss can on it. So you motherfuckers yeah. talked me into this, and I'm all right with it. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on here? Blackfish! I can't wait to get Nick in his car tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> the following day. Guys, the Termi just got finished up getting tinted. The black roof that we did last night mixed in with these wheels in combination with that tent is just freaking unbearable. It's so damn nice. Now that we got all of that finished up, we're gonna go ahead and take Nick Z. We're waiting on Jess to get here. We're gonna go run all three of these cars, see what they do. And really, I just gotta test out this car with its new setup. This is unreal. I don't think I've ever gotten to be around a Terminator that looked this freaking nice, dude. Like every single part that we installed on this car has come together so beautifully. Those beefy 335s back there, just freaking crazy. All right, I can't even, I can't even take it anymore. We gotta get this thing out on the street and go drive it. Unfortunately, obviously we just got it tinted. I can't roll down the windows, so, um, sorry about that, but let's go ahead and get on the road and we'll go see what these things do. Third contender. Who's saying? winning? Oh. Oh, Who's winning, Daniel? Winning? Who's winning, Daniel? I have my votes on that one. Who's Sorry. winning, Nick? Who's number one today? Number one? What car is quickest? Well, yeah, the Terminator. For sure. <laughs> I don't know. I, I do. <laughs> I really don't. I really, really don't. I think the Z and I got Termi are going to be top two. Sorry, Jess. Yeah, so I got top two. <laughs> Prove me wrong. All right, let's go. God, this car dead hooked, man. <laughs> This shifter, this stock shifter, we didn't get to replace it with the MGW yet. This thing, I missed second gear. <laughs> so if you look, there's like a five inch throw or something crazy. Like watch, way back here, I can fit like a palm of a hand between the radio and then we go up to third and now there's like an inch. <laughs> All right. shifter <laughs> dude i did not expect this terminator to be this quick <laughs> do not roll down i wish i could roll it down so much it feels so weird driving a car and not having the windows down i don't know if you guys are like me or not but i can't like I, everywhere that i go the windows are down yo what's good what's good danny all right you're gonna pull around and run nick and then whoever wins out of you two is racing gavin he was scooting yeah it he was, was scooting. scooting it was definitely scooting go hit second that time i'm seeing i see what i was doing this shift is a little weird but i can get it i can get the hit on it all right let's see how this goes all right you ready i'm ready all right ready three two one go you missed third yeah i have his picture right there He's on. <laughs> all right let's go again you ready there they go they're off Three, two, one, go! Woo! All right. Oh no! Nick got her by like.
like a Carly. <laughs> he, did, <laughs> he introduces out the window. <laughs> All right, it's between you two. Yeah, tell Nick. He's gonna need the jump. Yeah, let's say, go. you just leave whenever, and then I'll give you like a two second head start and we'll catch up. All right, sounds good. Sound good? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna ride with you for this one. Come on, Danny. You, you gonna need the weight, you're too fast. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's probably gonna need a good jump. just that it is like such a good chassis yeah. it's i would say that's a good way to put it it's just a fun chassis yeah Ooh. Ooh. to run from a dig? All right, bet. Let's find somewhere up here. All right. Tell Jess I'm gonna give her the hit. She can just line up beside me and then go whenever and I'll take, I'll follow. First dig race in the Terminator and it's against my girlfriend and her Mustang. Let's go. Still couldn't hit third, dude. This shifter. I'm not. I'm not being mean, you know. Ford. I get it. I get it. Y'all were going through a hard time, you know. But at the same time, what is this? <laughs> I miss fucking third too. <laughs> yeah, I swear. You want to try again? Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm not going to lie though, she really, well I mean I'm, I'm giving her the hit, but she's doing good on the launches. Man, that was solid. This thing's quick, dude. If it had a shifter in it, and um, this car <laughs> really would probably be like a, a low 12 second car, mid 12, I'd say mid 12s probably, that's what it feels like. It'd be like a 12 6, 12 7 at the track. Maybe we'll have to go run it at the track, I don't know. Dude, that was lit. That was lit. That was dope, man. <laughs> hey. Congratulations, nice driving. Nice driving. Give me some dat, bruh. Yeah. Anyways, guys, that's gonna be a wrap for today's video. If you guys wanna get your entries in to win this exact Terminator Cobra, go to itsjustasix.com right now where every dollar spent is gonna get you automatically entered in to win this thing. I mean, like seriously, this is my favorite giveaway car yet. I'm happy to say that every giveaway that we've done, I keep saying that over and over because it's true. And that's the best part about this is like, it's crazy we did a twin charged Hellcat last and I never would have thought that this would be above that in my eyes, but it really did. It just, this has blown my mind. So if you guys want to go grab your entries in to win this thing, like I said, it's just six.com. Drop a like on this video, comment down below and let us know what you want to see with this car next. And with that being said, guys, see you next video.